You're getting to be a big boy. I'm just a kid who's four. Each day I grow some more. I like exploring. I'm Caillou. So many things to do. Each day is something new. I'll share them with you. I'm Caillou. My world is turning, changing each day. With mommy and daddy, I'm finding my way. Growing up is not so tough. Caillou beats the heat. It was a hot, hot summer day, and Caillou was getting ready to go to the swimming pool. He had a hard time getting his water wings on, but he was sure his flippers would be much easier. Now all Caillou needed was his swim goggles and his cape. What's this? A duck wearing a cape? No, it's me, Caillou. Whoa, better Whoa. take those flippers off. You might trip. I'm going to wear them on my hands <laughs> instead of my feet. Can we go to the swimming pool, Mommy? Oh, I'm sorry, honey. We can't go to the pool today. Why? Daddy and I have a lot to do around the house. Caillou was sad. He really wanted to go swimming today. Swim! 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 Rosie wants to go swimming, too. Oh, we'll try to go tomorrow, Caillou. But I want to go today. Gilbert's hot, too. He's got no water. Gilbert drinks juice! Mommy, Rosie's throwing her juice. Caillou, don't clean up juice with your beach towel. I just wanted to help. I'm going outside. Don't forget your hat. Oh, and Caillou, don't forget your sunscreen. But it's so sticky. You need it. The sun is very strong today. And it's hot, too. Well, here's something to keep you cool. Thanks, Mommy. Caillou couldn't help laughing at how silly Gilbert looked. <laughs> but he was still sad about not going to the swimming pool. You're hot. And sticky, too. You need a good washing up. And cooling down. <laughs> You set it up, and I'll turn it on. Okay! Nothing's coming out, Mommy! You, <laughs> you tricked me! <laughs> Come on, Caillou. Jump in. <laughs> so Caillou found out that you can have just as much fun in your own backyard. I don't know about Gilbert, though. <laughs> Come on, Gilbert. Jump in! <laughs> Backseat driver. Caillou was looking forward to going to the restaurant for supper. soon. Daddy, I'm hungry! 
hungry. Rosie hungry. I know. Mommy's waiting for us at the restaurant. It won't be long. Ow! Daddy Rosie broke my car. I'll take a look at it when we arrive. We'll be there soon. with Rosie and he was hungry and hot too. Both of you, please stop. Look, we're moving again. <laughs> oh no, what now? Daddy, I'm scared. Everything's going to be fine. I'll go take a look. Just great. <laughs> Caillou felt bad that Rosie was scared and wanted to make her feel better. Okay, Rosie. Daddy? Yes, Caillou? When are we going to see Mommy? First, we have to wait until the tow truck arrives. It shouldn't be much longer. He's going to tow us to the garage. Okay, folks, we're all set. Are we going to ride up there? No, you're going to ride in the truck with me. Have you ever ridden in a tow truck before? No. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. You'll see. How's it going back there? Are you going to fix our car? No, I just tow him. But you'll meet my dad at the garage. He's the one who fixes him. Your dad? Yep, like it says on the side of the truck, Sullivan and Son. I'm the son, Jack Sullivan. I'm Caillou. My daddy doesn't fix cars. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty sure that your dad knows how to fix a whole bunch of things. My daddy has a wrench and a hammer in his toolbox, too. Really? And he can't fix a car. <laughs> Can you fix my car? Won't be a problem, son. I'll have her up and running in no time. No, my car. Rosie broke the wheel. Why don't we let Mr. Sullivan do his work? We'll fix your car later, okay? Okay. In a minute, Caillou. I have to call Mommy first. I'll get you a snack, Caillou. I want a chocolate bar. Oh, did I press the granola bar button by mistake? I'm sorry, Caillou. Can I press the button? Make sure you press the right one. After having heard from Daddy, Mommy was happy that everyone was safe and sound. Oh, hello. I'm not used to seeing you dining alone. Where are Caillou and Rosie? They'll be joining me later. They've been held up. Hmm, what do you recommend this evening? Uh, Mr. Sullivan? Down here! 
All done, Caillou. Your car's all fixed up. Daddy's car is fixed, but mine is still broken. Mr. Sullivan, would you mind if I borrowed a few of your tools? Not at all. Help yourself. Aha! Exactly what I need. Caillou was happy that his daddy was able to fix his car. He loved helping daddy fix things. Was the garage fun? Yes! We got both of our cars fixed. Both cars? My car was fixed too. Lost and found. Okay, Caillou, remember what I told you. Keep your eyes on the ball. I got it! That's okay. Just take oh. your time. Hey! Give me my ball! Come back! Daddy, help! He's got my ball! <laughs> gotcha! He has a collar, so he must belong to someone. Well, we've looked a long time, and no one seems to know whose dog this is. He's all alone? He must be lost. He's a scruffy little guy, isn't he? Scruffy? We could call him Scruffy. Oh, could I keep him, Daddy? Please? I'm sorry, Caillou, but this dog probably belongs to someone who misses him very much. Huh? I'll tell you what, though. We can help find his owner. How's that? Okay. Caillou was sad. He wanted to keep the dog all to himself. Hello? Anybody home? Who's this? I found him. His name is Scruffy. He was lost in the park. I thought we could help find his owner. Why don't you two take him outside and clean him up? Time to rinse him off. <laughs> ah, look out! It was time to look for Scruffy's owner, so Daddy decided to take his picture to put on a poster. Smile, Scruffy! <laughs> Perfect. Now we just have to make copies and buy some dog food on our way home. What if no one calls Daddy? Can I keep him? We'll see. Taking care of a dog is a big job. Hello? Yes? Uh-huh. That's him. Great. See you then. That was Scruffy's owner. She saw your poster and is coming over to pick him up. She's been so sad since we lost Rocky. I'm so glad you found him. It was Caillou who found him. Right, Caillou? Do you have a dog? No, but I have a cat. His name is Gilbert. Really? You're lucky. I wanted a cat too, but my dad is allergic. Time to go, sweetie. I'm so happy you found him. Thanks for taking care of Rocky for me. Even though Caillou was sad that Scruffy was leaving, he was very proud that he had helped. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye. <laughs> Gilbert! Holiday magic! <laughs> Caillou loved looking at all the Christmas lights in his neighborhood. He was very excited because today he was going to visit Santa. What are you drawing, Caillou? A picture for Santa, so he'll remember what to bring me for Christmas. That's a great idea. What are you going to ask for? 
Caillou was having a very hard time deciding what to ask Santa to bring him for Christmas. What about a toy car? Caillou finally knew what to ask Santa for. When are we getting a Christmas tree? Today, right after Dad finishes up his work. He could hardly believe it, seeing Santa and decorating the tree all in the same day. Caillou, <laughs> we're going to put decorations on the tree, not on you. Where's Daddy? I think he's still on the phone. He'll be out in a minute. I'll go get him. Daddy, hurry! We're going to see Santa! I'll just be a minute, Caillou. You're tracking snow into the house. Caillou was very impatient to see Santa and wanted Daddy to get off the phone. Okay, thank you very much. I'll talk to you soon. Come on, Daddy, hurry! <laughs> okay, okay, I'm coming. You know what? I think I better go to the bathroom first. Go fast, Daddy. <laughs> this is a switch. I usually have to wait for you. I'll just be a minute. Caillou, wait for us. He was very excited to go and see Santa. Caillou! Daddy? Caillou was afraid to get on the escalator by himself, and Daddy was already on his way up. It's okay, I'm coming down. Daddy looked very funny walking down the escalator going the wrong way. <laughs> That's the wrong way! You're right. The up escalator is only for going up, but I had to come and get you. Clementine! Hi, Caillou. I'm gonna tell Santa what I want for Christmas. Me too. What do you want? I want a new doll and a jump rope and an oven so I can make my own cakes and cookies. And maybe a new teddy bear or a big fluffy dog. What are you asking for? But that's only one thing. Caillou wasn't sure if he should ask Santa for more, but all he really wanted was this one special thing. Watching Clementine with Santa, he was suddenly a little nervous to go up and ask him for what he wanted. Go on, Caillou. It's your turn. <laughs> What's this? A picture for me? I love getting pictures. Did you write your name on it? Well, then you'd better tell me your name so I don't forget who it's from. Caillou. <laughs> this is a beautiful drawing, Caillou. Why don't you climb up here and tell me more about it? Caillou was very happy that Santa liked his drawing, and he didn't feel shy anymore. <laughs> Why, this looks like a dinosaur. Yes, it's a dinosaur that walks and talks. <gasps> you mean you want a real dinosaur? <laughs> no, a toy dinosaur with batteries. <laughs> Phew! I don't have many real dinosaurs at the North Pole, but I think I just might have the kind that you want. Yeah! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Caillou! Caillou was happy that he had asked Santa for a dinosaur. And who's this? Rosie's my sister. Rosie? That's a beautiful name. And what would you like for Christmas, Rosie? <laughs> Rosie's a little scared, Caillou. I think we better wait until next year. I'm going to bring you something special for Christmas, Rosie. Bye, Caillou. <laughs> Have a merry, merry Christmas. Caillou was proud of being a big boy and not being afraid of Santa anymore. Where are the trees, Daddy? Sorry, I just sold my last Christmas tree to that family over there. Look at my tree, Caillou. We're going home to decorate it. Bye! I want to decorate a Christmas tree, too. I'm sorry, Caillou, but there are none left. There you go, kid. If you come back tomorrow, I promise I'll have the best tree waiting just for you. 
I won! I won! So, I'll see you folks tomorrow. Merry Christmas! Caillou was very upset. He didn't want to wait for tomorrow. He wanted to decorate the tree today. want to be outside. He wanted to be inside, decorating a Christmas tree. Why can't we get a tree, Daddy? The man said he'd have more trees tomorrow, Caillou. But I want to decorate the tree now. You know what? Maybe we can. Really? Why don't we go inside and get that box of decorations? We're going to decorate us a Christmas tree. a tree inside? Of course we can, sweetie. Caillou thought he was the luckiest boy in the world. Santa Claus was bringing him a dinosaur, and he was going to have two Christmas trees. Ready? Wow! Caillou thought it was the most beautiful tree he had ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> 